I tried to be aware on this and uh, the transition went forward and it still could surprise me really because I realized for example my sexual appetite absolutely decreased in this time but when I actually could find a real partner in every way, a real one I found uh, the pleasure and the time is much longer than I ever had like a man and I was pretty happy about this I'm still pretty happy about this if I could have <laughs> uh, <currently. laughs> so um, yeah I have met with a young artist it was a kind of strange story from the beginning because I didn't understand why he's looking for my company. I know him a year before. Uh, he was in my eye a child, I'm sorry. Uh, I guess he's 20 years younger than me or something like this. And he was a goofy kid when, when I have met the first time with him. Yeah, really nice, naive and funny and I was talking with him but it was really, you know, I didn't saw in him a man at all and after that our connection it stopped so it was only an intermezzo for one or two days and after that we not keep in touch also if he lived in that time not so far from me over the mountain, I mean, I'm in under the mountain and he was on the top. So, <laughs> it's a kind of funny. Top on me. What the heck I wish for. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, he invited me and from the beginning I had no idea. It's now it's a date invitation which I, on, I didn't know he, how it changed in a year but it was Valentine's Day uh, he didn't want to tell me why he invited me because I told him if he more interested in the art exhibition and so on which we organize here uh, it's better if he contact my business partner because he speaks perfectly native speaker Italian and German so it's easier than communicate with me and so on and so on, but he always said that you only can do it in person. So before I went for this meeting, I was asking uh, my friend, who knows this guy too, what his opinion, I mean, I really have no idea what I should expect. Uh, should I take it really easy and, and, and or it's a kind of kind of date because somehow I had this impression but I was really hesitating to to see the things like that but okay we agreed in a time we met uh, and then I was shocked <laughs> yeah the guy uh, he's uh, come from Russia he was addicted not Russian he is Armenian actually if I understood well so he has a darker skin with dark hair and so on and in a year he lose all the baby fat I'm sorry about the metaphor but he became a so adult man he looked like 35 in, in his age and mostly mentally uh, we started to talk First we was really modest, we drank uh, coffee <laughs> but then we drank wine, then cocktail, hard one, <laughs> so we go forward and we were talking about art and, and uh, he moved out, how his life is going, he is lonely, he is single and so on, you know, nothing is stuck me for me. So I felt okay, I fall in love and that was crazy because that was a 40 hour long date and I was crazy in love 
so intense, so incredible. I talk this not normal. I'm, I mean, I get mad. I get mad. Absolutely. He was so cute. He was so intellectual. He was so partner in the conversation and every kind of way I was absolutely attracted. I, I hardly could resist to, to not touch him. Stupid. <laughs> and, uh, and I couldn't sleep that night because uh, he's a really talented artist. Now he's run away fortunately. Followed my advice, which I was wondering. Because he wants to be a great artist, which I guess he will be. I'm quite sure he has all the skill and the will and the, the power for act. Everything together, I'm sorry. So, so he, uh, I, I, he is really a great future in, in front of him. And, and I talked to oh my God, Dobby. Sorry, that's my old name, Emilia. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot ruin him. I mean, I know the circumstances here. He's absolutely in the society because he grew up with them. I'm not, and I know if he, I let these things happen, uh, if he wants, then it's a huge crash, I mean, in his career. So I could not stay because I fight it with my emotion. I have to stop. I should not feel anything. He's a nice guy. He's a child. We are not match. Blah, 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 blah. But you know, hormones. <sighs> nice things. <laughs> and in the morning I told to my friend who lived with me. Uh, I decide, okay, I let things calm down, I don't try to be in contact, uh, if he contacts it's okay, um, and I try to be cool, because it's the right things to do, and yeah, unfortunately he didn't talk the same like me, because on Monday morning at 7 o'clock he continued just, we just finished, 